Hello everybody, quickly before this episode starts, uh, I gotta explain something. There is an issue with my audio and the video here. My voice is out of sync with my video, uh, and the and the, the game audio itself is also out of sync with the video. There is nothing I could do about it, unfortunately. It just, there is an issue with recording this episode. I don't think it's in any of the other videos after this. I think it's just this one. Uh, I apologize for that. Uh, the only difference really is I turned down my game audio so you guys can't really hear it as much because it's out of sync and all that. And you're also going to be hearing me celebrate or be sad about things a few seconds after it actually happens. So, enjoy the episode. It's the rockstar thing. It's the rockstar thing. It's the rockstar thing. Okay, the music's like overlapping now, and now it's really confusing. Now, hi, my name is Chris, and my name is Matt. No, my name is Bunny Foo Foo. Get it right, scrub. Screw. If you haven't figured that out, that was they were both wrong. We're we're filthy liars. Don't, don't lie to the people. How dare you? That is the most disgusting thing to lie to the people, Max. I'm not uh, lying, I'm though. <laughs> I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Me trying to cry and not really cry. If, they, if you really cried like that, I'd be concerned. Now I know. <laughs> what if you actually oh, cried that, like that? That fall is so slow. Oh, no. What if you cry like oh oh, oh 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 what if you cry like that but like no tears came out of your eyes or anything it was just that voice and that was it that was your <laughs> only it. indication it's just that cry. voice <laughs> uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh I missed the freaking ring and I just went through a teleporter. what are you doing I'm doing the ring challenge in um knickknacks and smell of thangs you know everyone's favorite thangs right. And you're right. doing a rock slide macho challenge, right? Okay, you gotta jump at the light. How did I know? It's because I'm a psychic genius. Yup, yup, it's true. Ask your mother. She knows the truth. Cool beans. Okay. Now I just gotta do the rest right. Matt, I did the hard parts, so... I don't like cool beans. I like baked beans, okay? I like baked beans, too, I agree. I also like black beans on my Moe's burrito. Oh, you know, I was just I was thinking, is that thing I don't like? But no, it's black olives that I hate, that my girlfriend oh, I, absolutely I, I loves. Don't, I don't like olives in Blech. general. Yeah, I mean either. They're just... Blech. 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 Yep, that's exactly it. <laughs> yep, that's, ba that's like basically my entire expression about olives right there. That's pretty much my entire existence right there. That noise. That That's, that's very sad, Chris. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> I live for the bleh. My entire existence is bleh. I feel like it. Okay. Oh no. I got a minute and five seconds. Can I do it? Got no, a minute, minute and 35 point. seconds. I'm sorry. I don't know. Did you memorize the secret routes? I believe I did. I think I, I think I'm doing. Oh no, I died in it. Way to go. That's the worst part about that. You can't die once in like that span of five minutes of madness. Yup. Of insanity it's... central madness. Oh, 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 I'm at the end of the ring challenge. That was easy. Oh, nah, I uh, you said you said these uh, those things were hard. I'm like, nah, it's not bad. Well, I didn't remember how hard this one is. I think I don't like this one. Just oh, you, this is that you did knickknacks. Yeah. Knick oh, I thought you were talking about Sunday driving. And I'm like, nope. Sunday driving isn't hard. But you were like, yeah, it is. And then I'll find out today at some point. Maybe not this episode, but sometime today. That was a bad decision, but I think I still survived. I think I'll still have enough time, so I'm going to go for it. So I read a comment recently. Uh, we, okay, we just uploaded the episode where I pretty much spoil the fact that the last combat cha challenge is like a ju just a jellyfish. Yeah. And someone commented, thank God, I hated that joke so much. <laughs> <laughs> <Good. laughs> they were so happy. I wonder why you hate it so much. It's like if you know what it is, then it, like it doesn't affect you at all. I don't know. 
Alright, I'm now doing the Mothra challenge of Nick Nat, which is only a minute and 50 seconds, but... I'm sure I guarantee I've made that joke a few more times since then. <laughs> like... Yeah, but I think I spoil it each time while I just say something stupid. But... <laughs> Patrick seeing his friends and family, they're all dried up and deaded. Good, Patrick. Use the sadness as energy to destroy your enemies. <laughs> Use the sadness as energy. Of course. <laughs> oh wait, that's right. We don't have a sun. Oh yeah. I don't know if that's from or what that is, but okay. That's the episode where Patrick's parents, but they are. Oh, all oh, right, right, okay. I, I remember that. It's hard to recognize these vague references sometimes. Okay, so what if happens if I just die right here? Okay, so I've officially made a decision, and if Chris objects, then he can object. I object! But I have an I, I, I just came up with a thought. Um, so, You're um, thought. we don't know if I'm, if I win the race, then I won both races, and that's like cool. But if Chris wins the race, then we need a tiebreaker. Mm -hmm. Now, I know that Chris currently owns the creature from the Krusty Krab, but he doesn't own the other probably best alternative choice to that which was your friend revenge of the flying dutchman <laughs> so i think i think i died <laughs> oh no oh, since oh. i'm equally inexperienced in both games and i've only beaten Two. them once um and chris hasn't beaten either of them yet although he has as of this recording played a little bit of it mm -hmm. um but we i think we should have this be a suggestion box do you want us to do Creature from the Krusty Krab or Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. Ooh. And this is only in the case that Chris wins, unless we decide otherwise. Yeah, leave a comment down below. Because <laughs> we all know Chris is eventually going to let's play both games anyway. <laughs> yep. I'm sure I'll do Truth or Square as well eventually. Yup. That'll probably be the last one I do because... Well, there's only, like... Oh, I mean, you could do the portable ones, but those aren't... <laughs> no. Like, all of them aren't as good as the console ones. I have a really bad taste in my mouth from playing... I played Creature from the Krusty Krab on Game Boy Advance because my sister got it for her birthday, and I played it yeah, for maybe five years. That's by like, far nope. the worst port of Cre the worst version of Creature from the Krusty Krab. Yeah, it was really bad. Um, the DS one's pretty bad on that one, too, because that's all touch controls. Uh, maybe it was a DS one, I don't know, but it, it was something. And They're all bad. Horrible. Like, the only good creature from the Krusty Krab is the console one. Um, whereas the movie game and um, Revenge of the Flying Dutchman are both great on handheld. Um, and Battle for Bikini Bottom is pretty forgettable. I think. Uh, I don't know, I haven't played it in a while. Oh god, don't, don't touch me, ice cream. I'm gonna lose now, it's gonna be horrible times. So yeah, now I'm doing Sunday driving. I'm doing challenging. <laughs> Is it? I don't know, it's like an asthmatic fit there, but yeah, it's horrible. Well then, this this macho time challenge is also quite horrible. Also, I'm missing a chest in here, but I swear I got really? all three. Yeah, I think this we talked about this yeah. last time. I never yeah, instigated I, I it. Yeah, I was say, I think we talked about this. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Oh, swell. You swell, mate. The counter up top is really the one that's the most reliable, so... Pretty much. Until because we're, we're both to. operating on semi-broken systems, so... Yeah, well... I mean, Chris's Wii isn't broken, but, like, the memory card and other shenanigans. And the game's pretty broken, too, because, like, of shenanigans that happened in the first episode. Sure. Let alone and many other episodes. I just looked inside Patrick's pants. <laughs> what did you see, Matt? Yeah, I saw about... nothing actually, because like he's just a hollow. Just a ho he's very hollow, which makes sense given his intelligence quota. What if like people in like a SpongeBob game like programmed an actual like penis like under the pants that like, you obviously wouldn't ever see unless you like glitched through it like right, that. right. That'd be weird. Or just see, I don't. I don't... Uh, I mean, for Patrick, like, I could imagine them doing that. I don't know how you would make a Spongebob, you know? Like, I just don't know. Yeah, but I mean, like, as a joke thing. That yeah, 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 totally. Oh, no, I missed the dang ring! Did I get it? I think I got it. I don't know what just happened. Okay, I got really lucky there. Holy crap. 
No, I think I'm only at one burger left. I'm at the ice creams. Don't touch me, ice cream. Don't touch me. You know. You scream. We all scream for ice cream. Why is in that one part, and you don't know what I'm talking about because you can't see my screen, but why in that one part does is the fall like so slow? I, know I don't get it. About, we gotta fall forever. No, it's a, it's a relatively oh. short fall, but it just lasts longer than most other times when you fall oh, in the. It's because you're shell breaking toboggan. in the game, silly, except we kind of have to do that to beat the time challenge for some reason. I wonder if that was a mistake that they made the time challenge that short. Or they just like, they just put the time in like, eh, good enough. We beat the time at this much. It'll be good enough if we just yeah, I, I really seconds. wonder that because they're, because like, jumping on the sea monster at the beginning, like that should not be no. a method with which to beat the time challenge. No. <gasps> Third lap. Wait, did I do, did I do it? I think I did it. I did it. Did okay, you? we're good. I thought I, I no, I didn't beat the time challenge oh. yet. I just like, I thought I didn't land on the platform, but apparently I did. <laughs> like, that's cool. Ooh, I, I thought I had there. fallen below it, but I didn't. So that's cool. Oh man, I've been doing the kind of this rig. What? No, 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 no. That is unacceptable, bro. I've been doing this ring challenge oh, without crap. even really My thinking about it. Way too high. I just lap, realized really that. Out about it. My sensitivity is way too high. I probably was kicking everyone. Oh, okay, they're, they're right like... now, Chris, my audio is like lower. No! So you'll have to adjust it. But at least now I won't sound awful. And I can explain you why, too, awful. because I use the same mic um, because, I'm, because I'm poor and um, don't make like high quality. Like, I, may, I try and make high quality, but I don't make like expensive high quality, if that makes sense. So on my music review channel, I have a music review channel. Um, I use this exact mic as a boom mic because my camera mic is like not good, very good. So I use this mic as a boom mic now. But to do that, to turn the sensitivity up, and when I go and do local recordings like this, right, here we go. it's like, oh, it's easy softer. It's sadness. Okay. That's the end of my story. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I'm at the skate part of the ring challenge of the water slide. Uh, oh, I hate that part. Uh, this entire episode is just going to be me doing the rock slide. I've just established that at this point. Okay, one more, just one more ring, just one more ring, just one more. Yes! Okay, that was the part I was really worried about, and I had a lot of troubles with in my let's play, but I think I did it. Unless I. Oh, my hair's going so fast! I see the finish line! Yes, I did it! I won! Are you okay? No. <laughs> uh, For walking? Oh, my heart is going so fast. I think I'm probably having a heart attack. Have you done the macho challenge in Rock Slide yet? No, you haven't, no. right? That will probably be next episode, or whenever you finish it, just so the kind peoples don't have to watch us both struggle on that Die the on the same thing over and over again. Pretty much, son! I don't know why I called you son for. Oh no, I only have to beat this in 4 minutes and 20 seconds. <laughs> 420, am I right? Yeah! I don't have any nitros, so I can't go past- I can't go fast on the dirt, it's gotta go fast, you know? I thought you were gonna say I don't have any nitros, so I can't be 420, and I'm like, that's <laughs> not how 420 works. <laughs> Matt, you gotta inject the, f the nitros into your eyeballs. Don't you know anything? Jeez. I'm really surprised the ring challenge in this level doesn't go through the fake wall. Yeah, like you think it would, right? Yeah, but maybe it's maybe the game thought it was being more clever than it really is because it's pretty obvious fake wall. But <laughs> oh no! Oh, I thought those were bombs. Well, also they like train you to look for that crap, especially yeah, um uh, in the um uh stupid um no weenie parking. Yep, yep. Like, they yep. train you to look for that. 
Yeah, pretty much. By making it really obvious, but uh, <laughs> just so you know, there's hidden laws in this game. <laughs> Second left. You ready to be depressed though, Chris? I'm ready. I'm ready. After this game, there's no more after this game there's no more slides. Aww. There's that's... driving, but there's no slides. Aww. That's so, sad. It is very sad. It's not oh really so sad. sad. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I didn't have time to back away from the mic there. Lobster that was a bless sneaky you. Things. Thank you, Taiko, 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 Taiko. Oh no, it's the formidable ice cream that might kill me. Hey, it didn't kill me. My burger is so crushed and broken. However, will I fix it? Oh, I know. I'll eat another burger. That would that would definitely fix it. Go this <coughs> way. Okay. I wonder if any angry pairs. Almost done. Almost done. Oh. I just hope I'm fast enough. I hope I'm Santa oh, fast enough. fast. Well, you know if you get to well, the very the last... stupid toboggan goes this slow. <laughs> Jeez. Just say okay, if you get to I'm the last part. I'm at 340-ish. And I'm at oh. the lava jump part. So, if, if I can clear this in 20 seconds, we're fine. Like the last section there? The, yeah, yeah the last section. I'm pretty sure I got it. Yeah. You sound like because, me. like, I cut the, the big jump, I cut that really inward, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I cut off a crap ton of time. I know what you're saying. Yeah, I, made, I beat it by 15 seconds, dude. That's pretty great. Holy crap! Yeah. And you just used the method you saw in that video? Well, actually, yep. I guess you might have watched Yeah, I did the videos. method I saw in the video, but I, like, I jumped a lot earlier. Because I always, to do that, I jump at the lamppost. The lamp post. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Where like he jumps later, I think, in that video he, we keep watching. Yeah, he jumps at the edge of the. Yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah. I'll do this later because I just want to get, I just want to get this crap done. So, um, I'm gonna do googly eyes first because I don't feel like. Googly eyes. I feel like sliding. Your face is a googly eye. The only eyes. thing is, I have no clue how to do this time challenge because it's such an open-ended race. <coughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I feel like I should tell you how I did it, because if I don't tell you, you're not going to be able to get it. Because even when I kind of did it my cheaty way, it, Okay, uh, go ahead. Real. Okay, all you do is, once you get on the red wire, mm -hmm. you jump off. Oh, I'm not going to beat this time challenge. Dang it. Uh, you jump off the red wire. I don't even really know at what point, but it checkpoints you pretty much right before, um, you go on the lamps that like, lead to the end of the level. Wow, I died and so, I So, wait, failed. you jump off the red wire and die? Yeah, you purposely die once you're on the red wire, and then it, like, pretty much teleports you right in front of the, uh... Um... Pretty much the end. Okay, well, I'm gonna avoid that for now. Huh. Let's try... Well, I'm gonna try and do this normal time challenge the normal way. Yeah. And then see how much I beat it by. And then I'll make my judgments. Your judgments. Yeah, because I kind of want to try and beat it the legit way, because I had this beat, like, when I went back to my game file to, um, crap. When I went back to my <coughs> game file to, like, 100% it, because there were certain things I hadn't beaten, like that stupid, um, the stupid, um, Sonic Wave Guitar Challenge, among other things. Um, like, all of these were beat. Um, the only, the ones I didn't have beaten were the Sunday Driving Macho Challenge, which was really easy. Like, I beat it first try. Mm -hmm. Um, but I already had beaten the Ring Challenge. The, um, Macho Challenge for, um, Rock Slide. The, um, Sonic Wave Guitar oh. Challenge in freaking Shell City Dead Ahead. And like one other really easy token I just never bothered to get. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Yeah. I think it was in Pinecopolis <coughs> if I remember. Well, I'm trying the whole ring the ring challenge in the, the place I always call Cult Forest, but I never remember the real name of. <laughs> Shell City Dead Ahead. Yeah. Why is it not letting me lock onto the toast? What the oh, heck? Oh, I did it wrong. I did it wrong. Okay, well, I'm just gonna keep going because I don't think this should take this long. 
I love all the junk that's in this level. It looks really cool. Oh, Shell City dead ahead? Yeah. Yeah, it is pretty cool. An underwater junkyard. Ah, don't hit that box! I just remembered that, um, uh,. My capture card, or my USB stick that my stuff's on is kind of fullish, so I'm going to make sure it still records, so I'm going to glance at it every now and okay. again. Well, we're but, right near um, the end of the episode anyways. Yeah, and then we're after that I just got to delete now. some stuff, like the episode 11 and 12 footage I sent you, which shows how far in advance we're recording these. Yeah. This game's just too fun, we can't stop playing! <laughs> When you say red, do you mean pink or do you mean like orangey? Uh, I, I, I think it's red, but I mean, I guess it would be pinkish orangey, I think. No, there's two wires I'm talking about. There's one that's like pink and one that's like more orange. Uh, I'm, I, I don't know. I just remember the one wire. The one wire. Okay, well, whatever. I'm at the end anyways. And I beat, I beat this challenge. Like barely because yeah. I oh. I screwed up once, yeah. so I'm not too worried. How about, about how about this? The wire that y you have to take in order to um, exit the level, whatever color wire that is, that's that's the one you jump. Oh, on. this wire. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're at 20 minutes, so whatever. You oh, you're doing a time challenge, all right? What? I failed to beat it? No, that's not even reasonable. <laughs> I <laughs> beat it for watching, at everybody. I beat it at 2:30. Oh. That's not even okay. Later. Later.